is there an element of you feeling isolated at the top of the party at times because of uh, because you've lost all that support for various different reasons of course oh, f- far from it uh, like you mentioned people there who, who've you know moved on uh, into other careers and so on um, you know and, and we are a smaller parliamentary party than we were then and we have fewer ministers than we had then um, but you know the people I have around me now uh, include people who didn't vote for me, for example, uh, as leader. Um, the most obvious person being Simon Coveney. Um, he was my competitor mm-hmm. uh, when I ran for uh, leader. I don't think I could have had a more loyal, um, more trusting, more competent, um, more capable deputy than than anyone could imagine in the past three years. So he's um, keeping his seat at the cabinet table then? Oh, he certainly is. <laughs> yeah. Well, anyway, you you, you, I, I, you you managed to get me to say Don't that, worry. so I'm not uh, I'm not uh, I'm not um, not gonna not gonna. Yeah. You got me on that one. Anyway. <laughs> You can hear the full interview on the Indo Daily, available wherever you get your podcasts.